Mr. Jackie Thompson, check it out now. Well, well, well. Now, uh, I told y'all this fight didn't seem like it was going to happen. And after seeing more moving parts today, the likelihood of this fight actually going through actually diminishes as the days go by. Now, here's the thing. And I'm talking about, of course, Big Soldier versus Briss Breezy. Uh, listen, right? Initially, we heard, and we heard this yesterday, I reported to you guys, right? That the fight was going to be moved from L.A. or Las Vegas to Dubai, right? Supposedly, it was going to be in Abu Dhabi, right? The reason is that they have to go through drug testing and other legal stuff and regulations that would probably prevent this fight from happening. Both boxes are not, they don't have a boxing license, and this is not certified or sanctioned by the boxing committee. And, of course, amateur fights, there are rules to that as well, right? So it's a lot of things, a lot of variables going on. So they're going to move it to Dubai. Now, we didn't hear Floyd say nothing about no Dubai because he went on ESPN first take. He ain't say nothing about no Dubai. Actually, he did not know anything about Dubai. So what's going on? Now, we get to find out there's a third party involved here, and it's not 50 Cent. It's not Mike Tyson because Mike Tyson's only a trainer and 50 Cent is kind of with Floyd. But we're finding out that uh, WAC 100, OG Blood, is now controlling the fight. Now, we actually said in a statement to TMZ, listen, this is Pyru business, okay? Basically meaning uh, Chris Brown or Briss Brown and, of course, Big Soldier, they're Pyru members. If you don't know, Pyru is some type of a sect of the the blood gang. And yeah, both these guys are big bad blood. So it would be only right that the blood gang deal with the blood gang shit. So he says he is jumping in and he's taking over. He even put this on Instagram. He said, it's funny how all you out of town niggas is worried about what's what in Cali. One thing I can say is Chris Brown and Soulja Boy live right here in Cali. They moving around with a Cali nigga or two. But you same niggas that's two to 3,000 miles away hollering blood or cuz ain't never seen LAX your opinion on what we do don't matter it hold no weight that's why you same niggas is copying what we do we run us and then to like fucking I don't know red pill blue pill I don't know hashtag west up right and he said the west ain't never played the six man always the point man now Basically, WAC 100, he also said, and again, I can't put the full thing up here, but he basically said, yo, we're setting up this fight. This fight will be set up through me, through the Pyrus, and it will be set up in Dubai, okay? Now, as too many people jump on board with this thing, it becomes less and less likely to happen, because if you haven't realized... Everybody is jumping in on this shit, whether it's a Soldier Boy challenge, whether it's commenting on the fight, whether it's motherfucking putting up money on the fight, because all people are talking about is this thing. Then we see people like 50 Cent and Floyd, they don't give two fucks about these guys selling beef. They obviously have financial interests, right? They were the promotions. They ain't doing it for free. Despite what they say, they're giving a charity. They ain't doing it for free, right? 50, of course, wants the attention. Like he's amping up and instigating a fight. So basically, you're getting so many people jumping in the fucking pot. And listen, too many chefs in one kitchen only creates a fucking horrible tasted meal, all right? And this is about what we have. So it's less likely this fight's going to happen now. And again, a lot of people tell me it'd be a miracle if this shit actually goes down at all. But still, we enjoy the fuckery. Uh, we'll, we'll stay tuned for the next viral video by uh, Soldier Fraud. Okay, get the guy Mark Smith. You guys like, let me subscribe. Ayo, hey, are you guys following my new Instagram? Please, we got to get me to 100,000. I'm still at 70. Link in the description. Please go follow my new Instagram, all right? To a Jackie Demis, get the guy Mark